in El Islam, everything is in the middle. Can't go too far right, can't go too far to the left. So I come from an environment that was highly racist, and you're all living in an environment right here in the West. It is a highly racist environment, and it's systemic, it's institutionalized. I would go as far as to say 100% of us are racist in one way or another, except that the one that Allah made a ma'asum. Some of us are straight up racist, and some of us are undercover racist because we come and we grow up in societies where racism is pushed and pumped and psychologically it affects you. You don't even know that. For an example, for someone to say that Isa ibn Maryam sallallahu alayhi is the son of Allah. And then they give a picture and an image, an optic of Isa ibn Maryam being a white man with blonde hair and blue eyes and the malaika are white, and all of the good people of the Bible are white. That's racism. What it does is, whether people want it to happen or not, it makes the people who Isa ibn Maryam is appearing in their color feel superior, privileged, because God chose our people to make his son. So they're allowed to do all kinds of things and justify them in their head as the British did, the French did, the Americans did, the Belgians did, and Africa, other than that, and India, other than that. Do whatever you want to do to people, and it's okay, because there's institutionalized racism. Please like, share, and subscribe to the Digital Member YouTube channel, and hit the notification bell. Please also like, share, and subscribe to our Facebook and Twitter. Links in the description of this video.